Not only on the field, it's just off the field. I try to be a better man, a better person, you know. I try to do everything that the coaches want me to do as a better person and a better player. And the running back motto is success don't care about how you feel, it only cares about the process. And with that, what that means is that we're going to work, we're going to work, and we're going to work until we monster for the Hurricanes. Fourth and one on a handoff, and Harris breaks it free across the 50. At the 40, the 30, he's going to go all the way to the end zone for a touchdown. 66 yards. Cameron Harris. Basically a read by the quarterback. They get a good push, and you see De'Aaron King is just able to hold the defender up the field. That allows Cameron Harris just to get vertical and then just too much speed. A lot of times if you can split it on a short yardage like a fourth and one as the defense is selling out, there's no one left behind. On the handoff, it's Harris bouncing outside, taking it to the sideline. Well, he's already had a number of punishing so runs far tonight on third down conversions. And he busts it free. Harris again. And hurdles over a tackler down to the 10-yard line. You just see here, it's another one of these reads. Gives the ball to Harris. He just sips his way through there. Good job of the offensive line just sticking to their blocks. Six plays, 67 yards on the drive so far. It's Harris. Harris busting into the end zone for a touchdown. Boy, he's so tough to bring down on that first tackle. That was a four-yard touchdown rush, but another bruising run by Harris. Drive it, bruising run. Look at Harris. He does a lot of this on his own. Good movement there by John Campbell, but after that, it's just the finish of Cameron Harris. Warn Brian Brown's defense, more importantly. <laughs> Harris breaks the tackle. This is a defense that looks a little shell-shocked. They had the Canes backed up, and now Miami. Harris has the edge. Big fella accelerates down the sidelines to midfield. It's a foot race. Can they angle him out? Diving for the pylon. Touchdown, Miami. 75 yards. That is how you answer a long touchdown drive by the other team. Look how they designed this play. Motion. You motion, and it takes the defensive back with him. Look who's left on the right side of that defense. Nobody. You get to the edge, there's nobody left. They had four receivers after they motioned him all the way to the field. They go back into the boundary where there's no defensive backs left. So a great play. Third and three. Harris picks his way off the right side and bulldozes for a first down. Yeah, it's a very different looking nose defense. Where are all these dynamic? Harris dives. Touchdown, Miami. Two possessions and two scores for the Canes. A bit of a start of the season is 23 off to for this offense. I mean, he, he was instrumental last week. We saw him play really. That's a touchdown. We saw him play well in their opener, and now he gets another touchdown tonight. So he is a physical back, but he's worked so hard to improve. He's become an all-round back. He's worked hard in that weight room. There's a progressive pylon. Very easy for Miami. Harris has got it, and he will score on touch. And the Canes are rolling. Touchdowns in their first three possessions. Different ways. This time you get the five line, a great double team there on the left side. Clark does a good job collapsing on the big defensive lineman and gets up to the backer, opens that up. And there's no such a great re recruiting class last year. Cameron Harris now in the backfield, slips one tackle, gets the first down yards, lowers his shoulder, and picks up a couple more as he fights for yards and rattling off some first downs. They'll move quicker and quicker. King now faking the draw, going to his running back out of the backfield. Harris is going to walk into the end zone. Great, fantastic play call. They saw Pitt line up in zone. They knew the eyes would be soft. Good play pit fake by De'Eric King. Really good play. Watch as number 36, Chase Pine, gets sucked up on the play action play. And the running back, Cameron Harris, is able to leak out of the backfield.
Good sell by Derek King right over top. That's a wide open touchdown play. How depleted the secondary has been. That's been a challenge for Duke, and they like to play a lot of man coverage. Harris, look at this in the open field. Now getting behind some blocking as he crosses the 40. And finally steps. It's funny. We, we basically go from score, you know, scheduling games years out to basically pick up games. Harris again into the end zone. So once again, Miami finding pay dirt. Another touchdown for the Hurricanes. Movement. You know, one of the things they tell offensive linemen down here. In the second half, cuts the lead to 24. Well, this side of the ball is continuing to, to compete. Left side of that offensive line does just enough. Picks up Surratt, who's been leaking and getting into the backfield. But really been one of the major success stories for this program this season. Here comes Harris. He's free across the 20, cutting to the sideline. He is in for a touchdown. Cam Harris for the score. A 42-yard touchdown rumble. As they keep on coming at the Cowboys. Well, it's just split zone. They bring the tight end across the formation and just finds a crease. And Kim Harris, who I mentioned before, is a powerful back. But...